So if you want to find out if I like this song, guess you have to stay tuned and find out. Also, if you want early access and uncut, unfiltered videos, please check out our Patreon link in the descriptions. Thanks for checking out this channel, and welcome to the show. What is good, you sexy son of a gun? It's Philly, it's Taz, it's the Taz and Philly Show, and we are back with another reaction video. Hello, everybody. It's Philly and Taz. We're back with another reaction video, and we're getting into a little country flair tonight, it sounds like. A little Caroline Jones. Uh, the song is, well, I can't read this shit. Come in, is that what it says, right? Come in? Come in, and then in parentheses, but don't make yourself comfortable. <laughs> Thank you. Well, the fucking um, the, the text is like a centimeter. So, yeah, okay, that's what it says. So Thank you. I see... Uh, Got a little opening shot here. It looks like maybe a little motorcycle outside of a like a steak and maybe an ale at place that we're gonna go eat some food. Um, who knows? Who knows what we're getting? At? But believe it or not, and this is unusual for the channel, Taz knows this song, so um, he won't be blinded by another artist that he's never heard of. He knows Caroline. I, I don't think I know the song, so I will be the one that doesn't know this one, and uh, we'll see. So I'm not sure what we're getting. But looking forward to checking it out. So, Taz, any thoughts? You want to speak to what you know already, or you just want to just keep shut and we'll get into it? Shut up. Yeah, I'm not a huge country singer. I don't like old school country. You're not like, a country singer? That's great. I mean, I don't like old school country music like uh, Randy Travis and that, oh, yeah. that twangy type of country. But no. I like more like, I guess you call it modern country. Like the first time I heard a country song I like was Shania Twain. So she's like, I don't know, upscale country or whatever you call it, country pop. I don't know. But this is Carolyn Jones. I have heard this song before. Um, so I thought, let's introduce some country into the channel. Since nobody has uh, donated to request a country song, I thought I'd choose one that I heard before that I like. Hopefully you all like it too. Let us know in the comments because we want to hear your thoughts on it. So um Make sure that you support the artists. I'll have the links inside the descriptions to uh, represent them and show music appreciation. So, yeah, without further ado, let's get right into it. Hopefully, Philly has never heard it before and likes it, and I'll commentate more afterwards. So, uh, get your dancing shoes on, people. Here we go. Come in. Don't make yourself comfortable, cause I don't know if I'm gonna like you for long. Come in. The park your truck facing now, cause I wouldn't wanna be you when I want you gone. Come in.
Ready to clap, Billy. My favorite part. Yes, yes, yes. Talk to me, Philly. Oh my God. Oh my God. Go ahead. Tell me what you think. I'm dying to know. I mean, yeah. It's. I, I mean, it's obviously. Uh, well, I won't even say obviously because maybe not to everybody they would feel this way. But I, I thought it was catchy for sure. And you know, I'm not like a big country fan. Although there are some country songs I do like. And um, yeah, I went to a couple uh, like acoustic country sets before. One of them being Aaron Lewis. He has like a country thing. So it's not like I'm opposed to it. It's just not normally my typical. Uh, go to, I guess you would say, but this had more of an up, upbeat sort of flair to it. it. Had a little bit of like a rock riff. Um, you know, the dance part was cool. Don't get me wrong. The 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 video was cool. Um, definitely talented singers. She has a good voice. You know, you say you don't like twangy. Your voice is a little twangy. I know. I know what you mean, though. I know it's not. It's yeah. not. It's not like Willie Nelson country, but it's still there was some twang to it. But at the same time, it was an upbeat. Yeah. Still had some, yeah. It was, it was, it was a cool song. I can see why, um, you know, people would find that catchy or they would enjoy it. So, I, you know, caught myself bobbing to it a little bit. Definitely catchy, and um, I, can, I can appreciate it for sure. I'm so happy. Yeah, I, I apologize for that because she does have twang. So, what I meant to say, it was interesting. Like the song was composed, great the arrangement, and then it made you want to dance. It wasn't just. You know, so Twangy's fine with me, but yeah, yeah, I was hoping that Philly would like it. I hope you all like it. Like, we definitely want you to let us know in the comments if you've heard the song before, A, and B, if you haven't, did you like it? I mean, it when I first heard it, I wanted to dance and I wanted to learn the line dance. And actually, I went on YouTube and looked at different shorts and stuff of people doing like the line dance because it's really, really catchy. And I, I really thought that that main guy was cool how he did like his movement with the hat and everything, his cowboy hat it was just smooth. It was just like suave. So like, I look at all that attention to detail stuff. So yeah. So I'm glad Philly liked it. Um, yeah. Let's vote. I mean, wait a minute. Yeah. So, I mean, I love it. It's really, it's pretty basic. You know, it's a very flirtatious type of song. She's like, come in, but she's like, don't get too comfortable, you know? And I just love that. And I, I like what she said, keep your car, keep your truck facing out. If I want you gone, like you're ready. Like when it's, when I kick you out, I want you to already be in the direction of leaving. So I thought that that was yeah. really clever. It was just really something that was a little bit different. It had the country vibe to a T, but it also had that upbeat, like Philly said, it was upbeat that made you want to dance. And if a song moves you in whatever way, that's what I'm down with. So, yeah. So anything else, else you want to say? You want to vote? No, she just also told him that, that he wasn't getting in her pants either. And, you know. <laughs> Yeah, that might make some people not come in. So there you go. I know, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh yeah, Mikasa ain't Sukasa because I know some people think like, oh, they ready to bring a duffel bag in and stay a minute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, on to the next, right? I but I I did enjoy it. Let's vote. I guess it's answer pass. That is thumbs up, thumbs down. Why is it thumbs up, thumbs down? Well, if it's thumbs up, it didn't suck, so it's not ass, and we're gonna pass it. And if it does suck, we're gonna give it a thumbs down because it is ass. So it sucked because it's ass. It doesn't suck, so it's not ass. Ass or pass. Taz will count to three. I will drum roll. We will rate this together. Taz, are you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one. Yes, he likes it. Woohoo!
Yeah, come in. Just like yeah, that. Yeah, so just staying. Just little, saying little, 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 <laughs> so real quick, because I forgot to say it at the beginning. Hopefully, hopefully you're watching this all the way through. So, um, we made a couple. We made a couple of changes. We made we made a couple changes to the channel. You know what? I know where you live. So we made a couple changes on the channel, but what you'll end up seeing at the beginning of the video, so just read that there. Are a couple different changes and stuff, so I'm not going to speak on it because it'll be there for you to see. Um, and uh, yeah, and we we pride ourselves on being honest and authentic. Um, I read a couple reviews, not on our channel, but reviews like on Reddit and, and other formats. And uh, there's a lot of people out there that believe that all music reactors are not genuine. I can't speak for all the other ones. I can only speak about us. You'll just have to take us on our word. We're honest and authentic. If we haven't heard a song, we tell you. If we have heard a song like this one, I'm telling you, I've heard it. Philly has not. But it still doesn't take away its authenticity. Like, you don't know if I heard it before but hated it. <laughs> but, you know, so, you know, and we like to be honest. We like to have just a conversation between us and yourselves. We don't just give you content and tell you to just listen and not speak. We'd like you to comment in the comments. So hopefully you'll believe us. That's all I can say. I'm not going to beg anybody, but don't assume that because you might run across some reactors that are fake, that all of us are. Until you've said you heard every music reactor on the planet, you can't say that we all are fake. Facts. Mm -hmm. All right. Close this out, Bestie. All right. Well, I'm going to close you out. So it's time to close you out. So thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for, um, you know, enjoying the channel and always uh, interacting with us. We do genuinely appreciate it. And we will be back soon with some more. So I am Philly. That is Taz. That is the Taz and Philly show. Have a wonderful night. Peace. And take it easy and keep it breezy. <laughs>